Hello folks, so we are at the Polyfest 2018. It is the 43rd Polyfest here in uh, Manukau. And look, it is one of those biggest events that we look forward to. And I've got Dean, our media liaison, who's been working uh, for so many years. And Dean, how does it feel to be part of the Polyfest? Well, it's very exciting, uh, Hemant, and uh, kia ora and namaste. And uh, so, yeah, 43rd year and a record number of students this year. So there's 69 schools who have got school groups. There's 242 school groups over the next four days. Over 10,000 students are going to take the stage. So I'm excited. And everyone that's thinking about coming along, you've got to be here at the Manukau Sports Bowl over the next four days. And uh, the uh, Victoria University diversity stage has just started and it's an array of colour and culture uh, on stage today. Well, look, Dean, it's fantastic to see, and thanks to you guys. Look, we've got uh, people coming in uh, in their school uniforms. Soon they get changed. Soon they go get on diversity stage. Some are first-time performers. But today what I saw something was really different was that Mount Cook uh, School from Wadu Who. Yeah, Mount Richmond Special Mount Richmond, School. Sorry, yeah. yeah, and so first time they've been on an ASB Polyfest stage and they've been looking forward to it for some years and they've got the, the courage and determination to get on stage and um, it was absolutely beautiful. They did three songs, some Kapahaka, some Samo and Sasa and so very special to see that amazing school on stage from Mount Richmond. Well Dean, look at the Polyfest, we at the diversity stage but you've got many stages so over the course of next four days till Saturday this place is going to be buzzing with so many activities. It is going to be buzzing, yes. Yeah, six stages. So we, we talked about diversity. We've got the Māori stage, all the Kapahaka, and all the Pacific stages, Cook Island, Nui, Tongan, and Samoan. And so it is going to be alive with colour and culture and a lot of noise and also some great food over the next four days. It's pretty tiring for you guys and a pretty mammoth effort in terms of setting it up and putting it down, promoting it. So well done uh, to you and SMC for putting this great event together. And we'd love to support this uh, We'll and years to come. We'll well, Radio Tirana has been amazing so, uh, and been supporting it for many, many years. Down, and, uh, as, so and as you say, I hope that we can keep that partnership going three, uh, in two, many, many years go. to come. People who are coming over the next uh, three, four days, what are some of the tips they should keep in mind in terms of coming down here, finding a park, etc.? Well, I think the first thing is uh, wear a hat and uh, bring the sunscreen because it is going to be four beautiful days here. Um, bring some water, we've all we've got a lot of water stations on here. Um, there's plenty of parking around where you can park and, and walk. And um, so, But obviously my tip is to get here early, bring the sunscreen, bring the hat, bring the water and you're going to have a, a wonderful um, cultural experience. Well, look, it's a smoke-free, alcohol-free event, and do be part of it. Check out asbpolyfest.co.nz. We'll do our best to put details on Radio Toronto's Facebook and website uh, about this Polyfest, and um, all the best to all the participants here, and it's great to see this fantastic uh, diversity uh, stage and all the uh, Pacific Island communities join together for this huge ever, um, the best ever, you could say, uh, Polyfest. It's the biggest ever, and uh, you could be right. It feels like it is going to be the best, so look forward to seeing you all over the next four days at the Manukau Sports Bowl. Thank you, Dean.